So I rushed back uh, to Bangalore. Uh, and one of the first things I saw was, uh, you know, at uh, Gauri's uh, memorial, the kind of outpouring of uh, uh, sorrow and grief and uh, some anger. Um, and I suddenly realized something very uh, profound is happening. Well, it's hard to uh, pin down one memory uh, of her, but uh, I'll always remember very early on <laughs> when we were uh, our very first year of college, I think the very first year we met uh, one time, two-wheeler I had broke down uh, and she actually pulled me along uh, on a sort of fairly uphill road, uh, you know, till we uh, could get it fixed to a place where we could get it fixed. So, it, it spoke to me of somebody who who, who doesn't who didn't think of uh, you know that she was you know she had to be a woman or she she was helpless or weak. She always thought of herself as strong, and she was. Uh, she was small, she was wiry, a small build, but she was tough as nails. And of course, I've described in the book uh, the one episode where she actually, where she asked me, called me and asked me for contribution or to, you know, fund something. And her winning line always was, uh, hey, you owe it to me because I didn't get, uh, take any alimony from you. <laughs> so that was always a sort of, uh, you know, Trump line. How my memory, um, you know, is of her always helping out people. And she didn't make a big show of it. She was not... I mean, everyone talks about her uh, moment against, uh, you know, uh, corruption or casteism or this thing. But at an individual level, the number of people she actually um, helped, I'll, I'll, I can't forget her big heartedness. She was not religious at all. Uh, but at the same time, she did not, uh, you know, hate religion or she did not. I mean, there's a lot of nonsense which is being written about how or at least the motivation for the killers that supposedly from uh, everything I gathered is that she had to be killed because she was anti-Hindu. She was not anti-Hindu, no way, not by a long shot. Um, she was actually very proud of the progressive aspects of Hinduism, but she also criticized the regressive aspects, you know, the casteism, uh, the discrimination against, uh, you know, minorities or what, what are called uh, untouchables or the lower caste, so-called lower caste. And it's not uh, just the last uh, uh, four years, or it's not just the new BJP or uh, Modi government. I think even going back before that, uh, there is a sense uh, in our society that it's becoming increasingly uh, fractious uh, and agitational, and uh, there's a great deal of uh, anger and a constant outrage. She had fought and she was fighting a terrific battle uh, against these uh, forces. Uh, and to me, it was a story uh, worth writing about.